But all my tears have been used all And today I'm doing a day in the life of an LSE student, but it's a bit different, you know? I'm very extremely busy today, so I thought it would be really fun to vlog. It's currently 10 to 9. I have a GP appointment at 10 a.m., which is near my uni. The reason why I have an appointment is because I've actually been having panic attacks lately, and so I want to get that checked. Then I have two classes, so I have a microeconomics class at 12, and then I have a politics class at 1. And then at 2 o'clock I'm grabbing coffee with my friend Kofi, and then after that I am going to work so i bring you along to that as well where i mentor students then i'm coming back home to get ready because then i'm going out to go to an acs to the afro-caribbean society christmas party so it's a very very busy day okay so i'm gonna i'm gonna shut up now i'm gonna i really like this top guys it's from tiktok and i just like i know it's actually from tiktok like what like the world is changing okay, if you're watching this as well please subscribe if you have been watching my videos lately you know that i have just been banging on about how you know my goal is 1k my goal is 1k i'm really trying to push for 1k this year maggie real gangsters know about maggie i've literally added this to everything they say we are we are we are, we are. Apparently I'm a gorgeous girlfriend. No. Or maybe I just bought it for myself, who knows. Guys, this is a breakfast. This is where it's at. It looks really, <laughs> the plate just looks so empty. If I had time, I would have done like beans, toast, croissants. So just imagine that is on my plate as well. I don't know if my dad's watching this. He's gonna be annoyed that I'm drinking coffee because he says it's bad for me. But we just gotta charge it, charge it on a gang ting. <laughs> On a gangster, on a gangster, who's on? This is the fit. Put my scarf on. Oh shit, I need to put my shoes on. Get difficult to stand, but hold your balance. I just say whatever, cause there is no way you're bound. Everyone falls down sometimes, but you just gotta know it'll all be fine. It's okay. 
Okay, so I'm in one of the pods on in the library, and so it's not gonna quietly because there's people to do. I'm basically taking notes for the class that I'm about to have in politics. So I'm just gonna finish like doing a few readings. I've done like half of them for the class and so try and get through the others. I've got about an hour until my next class, so yeah. This is how I take notes for my modules, so I'll show you quickly but I'm going to do a full video on it. I use Notion and like for example this is my public policy analysis module, so I have it set out for each week. So because we're on week 10 right now, I'll go into this and show you what it looks like. So this is week 10, so these are my lecture notes. I also do like a quick summary here at the end of the week, so when I finish the class I'll do that as well. So these are my lecture notes. I try to just make it a bullet point format and make it as simple as possible to understand. You can find my reading notes here. So this is the first reading, what is lesson drawing. At the bottom this is a class note. So I haven't had the class yet but I've had to think about the questions that um, is going to come up in the class. But this is like my structure, it works really well. It's currently 10.56. I have a class at 12 so I've got more time. And this is music that I'm listening to. I love Ludovici and Wadi, especially whilst I'm studying. So good. The song. Literally, chef's kiss. I wanna take you somewhere, so you know I care. But it's so cold and I don't know where I brought you daffodils on a pretty string You can kind of analyze that specifically in the policy space I had a question as well if that's okay about the mm -hmm. pressure So when, like, I was trying to think of an example for pressure through coercion And I thought of the case where when the ozone layer was damaged And there was a hole in the ozone layer mm -hmm. And then countries, like, abandoned the chemical that was causing that Would you say that's, like, pressure through coercion or competition? Because oh, it went a, false today That's a good question, it's yeah. a very tricky one to be, be solved by using scientific evidence And changing something in what you, and how you regulate Maybe that's a bit of a learning mechanism because there wasn't no a Mexican tax list and they created like an entity called Patel rather than the actual name of the country. And then Argentina just copied that directly and it was just like this fake island that they had yeah. directly copied over. Yeah, so they had taken the list from, from Mexico. Like business uh, groups being like, absolutely not. So yeah, it should be taken into account because you can't just say it worked there, it's going to work for us. Learning from the best because we need in practice and be careful. That's everything for this semester. Merry Christmas, enjoy holidays. I'm not just on the internet. Uh, what do you want to tell my subscribers? Hello. <laughs> Help each other. Yes. We've just nice. been talking about how like you can share opportunities and just Help each other and do better that way. Oh, yeah. Share opportunities, be like Alicia. Aww. Help your friends out. It works out well. Yeah. <laughs>session went really well um it's basically like i'm teaching students how to debate but it's not about making them like the world's best debaters it's about the skills that they get from that so today we're looking at how to like structure your speeches to make them like effective and to make them persuasive so we're looking at peel structure and then just doing some examples my favorite activity that i did today was like the dragon's den game so if you've seen the dragon's den i love the dragon's den by the way especially the season that had stephen bartlett on it i literally watch every episode love stephen he's such a massive inspiration for young people um but yeah anyways we do a dragon's den game where i give them a really rubbish like quite boring dull object like a water bottle and they have to pitch make a pitch about that product and try and get me to invest into it so it's currently quarter to five I'm making my way back home. I will get home at about 5 p.m. and then 
I will get ready. I'm gonna have a nap, guys. I'm actually so tired. Like, today has been so busy. Like, this is a very much a busy day in the life of an LSE student. Not all of my days look like this. Some days I literally have nothing on. I'll just literally sleep and edit some YouTube videos. But today has been like so busy, which is why I wanted to take you guys along. So, hopefully, it's like a little bit of lighting as entertaining as possible. <sighs> oh, guys, I'm so tired. Guys, I'm so annoyed, like, I listened to Google Maps and followed the route that I told me to take to get to my friend's house. I was meant to meet her, like, 20 minutes ago at her house, but I was on the bus, yeah, that Google Maps told me to take, and I was just seeing, like, bus stop names that weren't, like, what Google Maps said it would be, and I waited 10 minutes to even get on that bus because it was delayed, like, like CTFL, it's actually so jarring. Now I'm, like, in this place. I don't even know where I am. Okay, I just got off at Paddington, so hopefully I'm not still lost. Because I'm gonna cry, guys. Please subscribe so that I, I find my way. <laughs> my friends are so rich. Like, how can you just live next to a river casually? So yeah, I didn't update you guys at all, but basically after work, I went home, I slept, I slept some more, then I slept some more, and then I got dressed, and mm -hmm. then I got here extremely late, and it's yeah. unacceptable. To be honest, I would have been extremely late even if she wasn't coming here, so <laughs> at least I have an excuse. Look how nice Angela's hair is as well. Look how nice she looks. Show them the dress, oh. show them the dress. Let's, let's, let's the do a skims, fit check. The skims, the skims. Oh, wait. <laughs> And I've got my Christmas earrings. Yeah, so cute. Thanks. And my hair is clipped up now. Yeah, because of I stole Angela's hair clip. Yeah. Going to eight oh five. It's a yeah. Nigerian restaurant, so should be good food. So cute. Yeah. Oh, you look so nice, you know, oh. in this lighting. Oh, what a buddy. <laughs>
I don't know what it is. Subscribe. Mock is. People vote. That's what we like. It's normal for us guys. You get it? Normal. We wouldn't understand if they have a team. It's a winner's mentality. We wouldn't get it. night it went well what time is it? Cool. almost midnight it's it passed our feet. bedtime because we we're grandmas you know what i mean we get to second year you're not doing this anymore yeah, yeah. <laughs> see students early night in spotlight moonlight nigga why you tripping catch moon ride try to look good in the moonlight all these pussy niggas so bad my spotlight moonlight nigga why you tripping catch moon ride try to look good in the moonlight all these pussy niggas so bad my spotlight I'm currently jogging home or hobbling because I'm so cold. I just want to get in, get into my bed, have a hot chocolate. Oh my God. This is my baby Christmas tree, so cute. Let me show you. It's literally three inches, it's so small. And my dad came to visit and he literally violated this tree. It was so rude. <gasps> Merry Christmas! I'm in such a Christmas spirit mood. I've got my gingerbread, gingerbread cookies candle. Can you even see it? Ooh, it smells so good, not gonna lie. Thank you so, so much for watching. Please comment below. If you're still watching this, what could you comment? Comment, Alicia is most likely to be famous. That way I will know that you stayed to the end.